All right, continuing our tutorial. So, um, I'm just going to see a few more things. Yeah, see, that's what I use for the game. Three, set resizable, set visible, set size, set focusable. Um, actually, not too sure what that. Oh yeah, okay, now I remember. Okay, so we're going to add a few more things. So after we have all the um, oh no, no yeah, okay, so this is our. So we have all the set size and all that, right? There's a few things you want to add. Frame dot set focusable and false. Um, and one more thing is frame dot add new board. Or actually, you know what? No, let's not do new board. Let's do um board board equals new board and this will call our constructor um, and then you just call it right here so it's adding the J panel that we created right here right it extends J panel so as you can you will, let's run it doesn't do anything it still shows up that's good we haven't ruined anything yet yet okay so um, when I'm saying board dot request focus we're going to have to put that down here Quest focus um true and actually these set focusable and stuff I'm not even sure if you need that I just got that from um some quest I I was actually having a little trouble with Gu again I'm not too good at GUI so I was asking a few people you know well I you know best way to set up a GUI and they said this is how you would do it okay so um board there's a few things we're going to want to create and we can probably get some frame save yeah okay um board we're going to want to add a few things first off we're going to want to add a timer we're going you could probably even forget about this right now timer and graphics 2d those are the things you absolutely need so you could do timer time and that's um hold on oh uh timer time yeah, you want to um, import timer Java X. Um, you could also add um, what is it? Hold on. Oh yeah, the graphics object. So let's make it a static, which means it can only be one at a time. Graphics 2D. Um, I need my draw, and the reason I do that is so that it kind of um, I don't know. It's it's an easy name to remember. Draw as if there's a draw actually drawing the graphics. Something else we need to do. Super. Uh, no. Wait, what am I even doing? Public void soup. Uh, super. I don't, okay. Paint. Sorry, I'm like really. Graphics. G. And oh. I'm probably not the best one to make these tutorials for you, but uh, I mean I I am the one who created the game, so I guess I guess I'm the one to teach you how to create a Laria type game. Public board. Um, we could um, for board we're going to want to create a new timer. So let's do time equals new timer. Set the amount of times it updates which is going to be 5 milliseconds and what it updates. It's going to be updating this giving me an error. Yeah that should be correct. Maybe I should do um set focusable true yeah okay um oh yeah I need to implement something action listener you want that I've completely forgot about that Durr. um so you add action listener and what that will do and let's copy paste this let's put up here action performed what this is is it will basically say okay when the timer updates what is it going to do so what things you can do is things like uh, update player there we go draw these are comments by the way I, I honestly think if you don't know what comments are then you are way too ahead of your time so as you can see in my actual action performed I have several things going on most of all I call repaint and so that's what I'm going to do right here. I'm going to call repaint and what that's going to do is going to call the super method in the J panel 
that's going to paint, and it's going to paint this. Or um, something else we could do is we could also do super dot paint g, and it's going to take this graphics object and it's going to paint using it. And you need those both. I don't know if I have super dot paint g in here. I probably don't. You probably don't need this. So actually, you can probably get rid of this. But um, that's actually probably about it. Okay, so um, you have the paint graphics G, and something you should probably do right now is um, set the drawer, because right now the drawer doesn't have a value to it. So drawer equals graphics 2D G. It's going to take this, and it's going to set drawer equal to that. As you can see right here, so that we can use drawer to draw with this. And I'm not actually too sure what goes on be all the behind stuff. Um, so yeah, you have that. Um, imported quite a bit. You can probably um, put it down. And there's actually, I think, yeah, okay, we're going to exit out of that real fast. Okay. So, um, we're going to create a new folder. We're going to create a new folder. We're going to call it, um, let's call it images. And hold on, I'm gonna um, show you something real fast. All right, so um, I'm going to be using this program called Paint.net, and what Paint.net allows me to do is it allows me to create images. Right now, I'm going to create a background image. So I'm gonna well, actually I already have one. I'm just going to use the same one that I have for um, my current real game. Going go down. Um, world, you shouldn't have this. If you do, then you're copying my game. Control C, so you somehow have the source of my game. And we're going to put it into here. And Control V. And what it does is you'll have a JPEG. And how you would really do that is if you had a JPEG on your desktop, all you have to do is just drag it from your desktop onto here into your images folder. So we have daytime.jpg. Um, let's basically create something. Uh, let's create so that the uh, image can get drawn. This is going to be my last thing before this tutorial is done. So let's name um, world background back, background. Okay, and um, I'm going to make this really fast. Image icon um, background equals new image icon on um hold on let me get for there we go we could do world background dot class dot get resource you're going to have to do this for all of your images and we're going to have the path as images day time one dot jpeg and one last thing is we could do public static void get bk. I'm doing this really fast. In fact, actually, hold on. Public static. You know, you want static. I really don't have time. Um, image. And then you can return background dot get image. Let's do this real fast. Import. Ball, background. Oh yeah, okay, that should have been static. Okay, and then the last thing I want to do, draw, draw or draw, draw image. Um, can probably do this. Um, world background dot get bk zero zero no. I will probably be trying to explain this later. Just trying to run through it, and as you can see, it did not work. Um, it threw out a couple exceptions, and let's actually go see why. Daytime one dot jpeg. Um, okay, I'll work out this. I'll work out why that's. Um, anyways, I'll see you later, guys, and I'll figure out why that's returning an error. All right, see ya.